Hey, this is Matthew Deer. Uh, we're here in my home studio in Brooklyn, New York. We're going to go out on the street and do some field recording with this really nice old tape recorder that I found. Check, check. One, two. Check. One, two. It works. Pipe. Ooh, these should be good. It's a nice long ring at the end of it. Pebbles. You know, went out on the street took the tape recorder, and it's, it's something I don't normally do all the time. Uh, so it's good to be kind of inspired to do something that's been in the back of my head. Yeah, I knew I wanted to use that one. Yeah, slowly start building faster. So now you got a rhythm just by doubling the speed of that. Dun, 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 dun. So let's do a slow one. It's never a calculated decision to sound like anything, um, at least from my point of view. It's, it's really, I'm just a byproduct of all this incoming music. I think like Kraftwerk is like a great example of that. Like they just embody this otherworldly kind of existence within the music. And uh, yeah, that's what, I, that's what I strive to be, I think, subconsciously. See, I, that's what I like to do, you know, I just like to play around and it's really like how you're feeling, like the mood of the day, you know, it's like, are we going to make this a happy song or is it going to be a sad song? I mean, it's, it's totally stream of consciousness and and I, I, again, it's it's another element of what's all going on in there that I don't like to check too much. You know, I, I don't like to question it and ask it what it's doing. And I think at the end, when an album's finished, you get a, a collection of stream of consciousness sections. So, so at the end, it is about me inherently because I, I did that stuff in the studio, and, it, and it's about a mindset and a way that I was, a way I was feeling but it's not necessarily a conscious mindset. So in the, in the sense, it's a concept album about me and like the way that I'm living. And I'm just trying not to like fuck with that too much. So usually I just start like making sounds with my voice. Um, my voice is supposed to be really rhythmic and uh, I like to kind of just fit into what's already going on. You know I like feels going mellow. Now let's hear that out loud for you guys. So the new album is called Beams. It'll probably come out at the end of the summer, uh, early fall, 2012. And in the meantime, I'm just gonna be touring with the new band. Those guys um, definitely bring something to the stage that you know obviously doesn't exist in the studio uh, where you guys have been. Um, in there, it's it's just it's a giant you know head trip. It's it's everything that I'm doing and everything that's going on within me and what I want to do with synthesizers. And when you bring it to the stage, it totally opens it up and turns it into this like live experience. And uh, it's cool because the songs just take on a whole different life. It's a very careful like split that you have to do because I want to give the audience something that sounds really cool and I want to do things live that make an impact but I also want to perform so yeah I think now I'm just kind of right in between but it's all natural it's, it's honest you know I, just, I want to do what I do in the studio as much as possible here Fun's a gun. 